Instead, he instilled them with some advice. Oh, wait. Um, homestead, another homestead mission. See what's going on now. Burglar on the homestead. Connor. 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 Stop. Not on my homestead. I'll stop him with a pistol. Just knock some people over. <laughs> they don't even care. They just plod right through them and they didn't even react. So, whoa, something's amiss. Yeah, no shit. The guy just charged right through you and knocked you over and you didn't. That, that's all you had to say? <laughs> what the hell? Give no second chances. Where's the trouble, Connor? So you tear past chasing a man. He was trying to rob your home. It has been dealt with. What? Women? Is everyone all right? You should have been there. What? I told you to head back. I didn't they need to. Since when is a skinny runt like you safe out in the bush alone? <laughs> yeah. These guys are always arguing with or something. Actually, the first time I met them, they were arguing. Walnut, lumber, and other items now available from lumberers. Alright, good. Mission was a success. And another homestead mission. It's nothing worth doing these. I mean, they're pretty interesting. Um, and then they allow me to get different items. Figures. I just need to follow the kids. Should I get my pistol out for this one? <laughs> Oh, I get a... Wait, what? I'll flatten you. Oh, I see. I have to keep the... 
Just evened out. What the heck? <laughs> oh, I think I have to... I think I have to push him back. Oh, okay. I see. <laughs> Cut it out, you two. I'm not gonna ensure the fight never happens again. I'll just punch each one and just knock each other out. I'll fight myself. There's no need for this. Yeah. He's a blockhead. <laughs> Don't kill off in a spell. Just need some time is all. They're quite childish, though. Are you not angry, Godfrey? Me? <laughs> not at all. Terry's just got himself a temper, and I won't let him get away with it. It's really no trouble. He'll calm down. The rut couldn't do much damage anyway. Does this happen often? Ha! <laughs> I was just telling Lance how I can set that calendar by these events. It's really not a worry, Connor. But I appreciate your concern. Spruce lumber and other items now available from lumberers. Alright, cool. Well, now that that's settled... I've well, got more people I can observe now. Uh, no more homestead missions for the for the time being. Okay. There's nothing I really need to do with Godfrey, apparently. Terry, on the other hand. I don't know. I guess I'll just figure it out. Oh, okay. He's an invalid target anyways. Terry? What about Terry? Also invalid. Catherine, Diana. Yeah, there's nothing I can really do with them. Okay, so L.A. Lance is doing something with a chair. Cleaning a chair. 
guessing that's what he was doing. Looked like he was kicking the side of it though, so I don't know. Standing a piece of wood, examining wheelbarrow con contents while writing in a book. Big Dave should take a look at this banding. So far, I've, I've seen him checking a fence, examining a wheelbarrow while examining, writing in a book. Um, cleaning a chair, and then I just need to observe him sanding a piece of wood. Big Dave should take a look at this banding. Uh, what is he doing? Look at that. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> oh. That's going to need some attention. <laughs> He's sticking his arms out holding his book and somehow opening a door. The hell? Uh. Alright, well, I got the woodworker finished. This game cracks me up with his glitches. Alright, so I'm looking for a hunter's, which I don't think I have yet. Lumbers. Yeah, it's funny though. Chopping wood. That's that's another thing. So putting wood in the wagon, that's another thing I observe him doing and using a two-man saw. Afternoon light. Good day, Connor. Oh, he's gonna open a door like a normal person. <laughs> Wouldn't sure. I mean, oh, they didn't stay. He didn't stay inside very long. Staring at a window. The hell? Game is bizarre.
What that is he have in his hand? Oh, it's a fishing pole. With no line on it. There you go. Now I have the line on it. Alright, lumbers. Lance's wood shop. Prudence and Warden's farm. Cutting wheat, uh, bees, collecting honey from the bee farm. Huh. So there's a lot of different tasks I can kind of catch them doing. Milking cow, plowing field, cutting wheat, tending the vegetable garden, watering the garden, feeding chickens. Our stores will be bursting if the season continues like this. Mm, tending the garden. Oh, yep. So they have, so they have livestock. They got vegetables. They got a beef farm, and they got a lot here. Actually, they're pretty resourceful. That's good. Was he going to be water in the garden? Oh, they're both just going to tend the garden. Three of three. Then it counts. No, I guess since it's two different people, I can actually observe them doing the same different thing. So that saves me time. Yeah, I'm okay with that. Alright, well I'm done observing the farmers. So that's good.
and the woodworkers. Blacksmith, doctor. I don't think I have. Let me see. Blacksmith, doctor, huntress. I do have a huntress. Lumbers, miner, tailor. Hmm. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Miriam's uh, a huntress. I got the woodworkers finished. Um, I got the lumbers I can work on. What do we have over here? Docks. So lumbers and hunters. I can work on getting logs for them. So I don't have to actually observe uh, everything that these different workers can do. Just three things. And if it's if it's a uh, two set if it's two set of people that do the same kind of work, it makes it even easier. I guess this isn't that bad, especially if you have a way of tracking it. But it is a bit, it is a bit much though. I can't even flip around the other side of the uh, ladder. I just have to get back up on it from the other side. I usually do well in this perch. Okay. So not exactly sure what she's doing there. Was she cleaning her musket? Firing, okay, so my options are cleaning musket, rotating food on spit, firing musket, setting traps, firing the musket at game, skinning deer. I have no clue what the task she was just doing right there. I mean, she could have been cleaning it. Oh wait, there we go, spinning the, the pit. Spit roast, okay. Returning the food and spit, so that's it, is it for that. Well I'm finished with the huntress, that was quick. Yeah, this is this isn't that bad actually. This is actually pretty straightforward. The only thing I can do now is Observe the lumberers doing some other some other task. That's really about it. Until I get more people in my homestead. Well, after I finish observing the lumberers, I'm gonna do some more uh, naval missions. And go from there. Alright, well, I'm done observing the the lumberers. 
Now I just need to observe a tailor, innkeeper, doctor, blacksmith, and a miner whenever I get them in, in my homestead. Mm, okay. Well, I got a new Captain Kidd's treasure mission I can do. I lowered the risk for sending my convoys. I think my risk now is like 5%. It's like a 5% risk whenever I send my convoys through. Because I've been doing these naval missions, I've been lowering the, the risk for the convoys traveling through. All right, so let's see. We have the Ghost War Act 1, the runs at Saros, which are DLC missions, the chase, and dead chest treasure. I gotta do jet, dead chest treasure because um, you can probably get some a decent amount of uh, money from this. All right, dead chest treasure, kids treasure, brave the perilous cliffs to recover kids map. All right, Dead Chest Island, 1774. Scavengers love the graveyard, so be on your guard. ship wrecked around here they must have been looking for something themselves hmm mm, 3,000 pounds yeah, this is pretty cool a lot of detail put into this I'm not gonna be on my guard though I'm not the only one looking for treasure. Yeah. Explore the ship graveyard. Scavengers. Huh. Running assassinations, stay within your target. Leave me be. I found it. What you carry is mine. Within 40 meters. Okay. Running assassination. Nice try. Not that easy. Oh wait, what the hell's a running assassination?
Guess we'll try that again. Perform running assassinations three. Stay within forty meters of your target. What you carry is mine. Nice try. Not that easy. So what is a running assassination? I don't get that. I guess I could just run up on that guy from and just assassinate him. Well, I gotta keep. I'm gonna keep doing this until I figure out what a running assassination is. As annoying as that is, because I need to do it for this. I need to do I'll do it for an set objective. Okay, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's all you have to do. You just have to quickly get up on someone and assassinate them. I like it. Why are you taking me? I've done nothing wrong. Stop and give me what I came for. Oh no. Yeah, I know what I'm doing now. Yeah, it's a new type of assassination, running assassination. So usually when you run up on an enemy, they're ready to engage in combat. But you can actually just assassinate them if you're quick enough. Makes sense. I like the concept. I thought I could, I thought I could run up this. I could. It just didn't let me. It made me like, slide back down. I ran straight at the wall, that was stupid. Leave me be, I found it. What you carry is mine. That's pretty cool. Double assassination. So now I can run short up of that. Maybe because I was trying to, maybe I was at a little bit of an angle or something. Maybe that was why. Whoa. Yep. Well that was fun.
What's he got this time? Let me see. Let me see. A veritable bounty. Shiver me timbers. That'll earn you one of these trips to be sure. I will be back for the rest. Explore the Octavius and find Kid's former crew member. Alright, cool. So I got a letter. The Animus database. Letter to to Hendrik von der Hoel. So how do I read that though? Am I missing something? Or am I not am I not not able to read it the letter? In the Animus database. Ah, uh, there we go. Oh, I never did read in, never did take the time to read these. I didn't want to add a bunch of reading. Alright. Letter to Hendrik Van Der Hoel. To Hendrik Van Der Hoel. Hendrik. You were my most trusted advisor and closest friend, and I pray this found you safely. You know what it is I had, and you know the power it holds. They thirst for it. I know not who they are, but I know for certain they are not after me in the name of any crown. They are something else, something secret, something relentless, something with resources beyond measure. Something that frightens me like nothing else I have encountered in this life. I am holed up on a farm just outside Boston, trying my most desperate and last dish attempt to rid myself of them, for it cannot fall into their grasp. I have sent you the last piece of my precious scroll that leads me to where I stowed it. Hold it for me. They are upon me. If I come out the victor, I will find you. If not, die with it. Captain William Kidd.